I'm Clara. If you are first time here, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and give me a like. Thank you. After much deliberation, we made a decision to start producing fabric laser cutting machines. It was a rather difficult decision, and we consider it for one year. If you have a good suggestion, please leave your comment below. We'll be very grateful. The initial idea was triggered by one of our long-term cooperative agents, who said that we have a very sound sales and survey system. Why not consider manufacturing your own cutting machine, especially in this time of pandemic? Many things have become uncertain, but surveys or remote surveys has become an indispensable and important element. Then we continue to receive various concerns from customers around the world, which prompt us to finally make this decision. The most common worries could be first. Some customers are worried about the price, especially friends who buy fiber laser cutting machine for the first time. We have received quotations from customers and wanted us to take a look. In fact, in the current Chinese market, the price of fiber laser cutting machine below six kilowatt has been relatively transparent. As long as the configuration is given, the approximate price will not be too different. Relatively speaking. The uncontrollable part is only after sales service, but service is an intangible commodity. Cannot fully believe the marketing words. More to rely on word of mouth to decide whether we should believe a supplier. Some customers will worry about the machine quality. In fact, in my opinion, as long as the configuration given and the manufacturer doesn't use. Fake and shoddy products. The quality problems of the machine are mainly concentrated in the assembly process and debugging, and the two factors will mostly rely on the practical experience and the expertise of the assembly engineers or a complete assembly system. Among the many laser cutting machine manufacturers I visited. Jingwei is one of the few manufacturers that I personally think is relatively complete in the assembly line system. Third, some customers will worry about after-sales service, especially in recent years. The pandemic resulting in the engineers are not available to go outside to install and train more online form, and I did. Come across some cases that the customers phone me and ask for installation and training. It could be laser cutting, laser welding, and even laser marking machines. What's more outrageous is that I have actually encountered that the customer received a machine that has not been debugged. And it should be shipped directly after assembly, which actually involves the quality of the machine. There is also that after receiving the machine, the customer cannot be contacted with the supplier. Another is that after the customer receives the machine, he tries to assemble himself, and then finds that the machine cannot be started at all. After we intervened. We found the wearing of the switchboard part was hugely confusing and mess. We were also terrified, which took us a full three nights to help the customer reinstall the switchboard and all the wearing. There are many, many more cases. I may spend the whole night talking about those strange things. In fact, what I want to say is that it's not easy for everyone to make money. You have demand, we have supply. It should be a double win situation, and this relationship should actually coexist for a long time, not a hammer sale. As a person, the most anxious time for me is when the customer receives the goods and starts using them. Because for me, the service doesn't really start until the customer receives the machines. When shipping, 
despite the detailed preparations, I will still worry about whether the customer will install, whether there are missing things, etc. and make files and video backups as much as possible. After the customer receives, I will worry about whether the machine has collided due to transportation, whether the customer will not check the documents I prepared, and so on. Let's talk about why we started to make FabLaser carting machines. In fact, the most important thing is because of the trust of our customers. We have several long-term partners who occasionally ask us to do several FabLaser carting machines. From their feedbacks, whether it's machine price, quality, or service, our performance is very good. The second is to receive continuous service cases from customers. A considerable part of them are new machines, and the customer bought the FabLaser carting machine for the first time. But their suppliers didn't seem to be able to give effective, timely training, so they are forced to seek help themselves. So what advantages do we have as a small manufacturer of FabLaser carting machines? I also asked my colleagues to sum up. There may be several points. First, we have a lot of experience. My colleagues and I have struggled in this industry for many years, among which I'm the youngest with five years. Second, the price is transparent and fair. We use a global flight price, which will not be treated separately due to different countries and regions. Closely related to the price is the configuration. In the same configuration, our price matches our service, mechanical quality, and more soft power. Of course, if what you need is a low price, we are certainly not the most suitable. Then it's better to leave us alone. Third, although we are only marketing FabLaser carting machine now, in fact, we have been supplying our long-term partners for four years. So do not doubt our assembly process. Fourth, after sales service, is professional, timely, effective, and humane. Let me give you two examples. There was a customer from Ghana named Alex. He just received a new machine, but due to various reasons, cannot contact the supplier. So he bought our one-hour training course, but we provide a two-hour course and at the same time, free of charge to help the customers set the parameters of the air compressor. There was also a friend from Malaysia named Victor, a very nice customer. He bought consumables from us twice, and then the amount of single purchase exceeded the amount we could give away the free course. So I booked a two-hour course with him, and currently only took one hour. The feedback is very, very good. For us, machines are like people. People get sick, and machines are the same. But as long as it doesn't involve replacing damaged parts, our problems are minor problems, and what is needed is patience and time. Even if the damaged parts need to be replaced, as long as they are not in the laser category, it's not a big problem. But if it's really a laser problem, don't be afraid. We can handle it. Fifth, the price of where parts is fire. You can compare our price. We are certainly not the lowest and highest, but we should be the more practical one, and the overall score is relatively high. Sixth, for each FabLaser carting machine, we'll give away five hours of training course for free, or consumables priced at two thousand RMB. This is targeted. If you already have a laser carting machine, it's okay to choose anyone. 
and five hours of course we can help you to solve your other fabulous carding machine problems if you are buying for the first time my advice is to choose consumables two reasons first you may need more consumables for experiments or tasks second any training and problem handily happened on the machine we sell is free and doesn't need to be paid there is a sheet in the description below you can download it and fill out if you do have the requirement to purchase the fabulizer carding machine attention right now we only open to do the standard models and the mental plate cutting in the end I still have to say something from the heart and very sincerely with customers and I also hope that customers will return with sincerity I'm not that kind of person who will quote the price carefully and then make a lot of small talks I hope that I can use my limited time to serve more and more demanding customers Okay, that's what we got today. Please leave it in the comment below no matter what you want to know. Next Tuesday, you will see a video to introduce the automatic fiber laser welding machine. If you still have the time, why don't you stick around and see another video. See you. Bye. The next step is to download the free PPS file in the description below. You can get a collection of my videos, which is easy to locate the video you want.